how to install Google Analytics 4 on WordPress using Pixel Your Site. And uh, if you use a commerce, how to enable something called measurement protocol in order to improve your uh, transaction tracking. I will show you everything that you need to do. Uh, and then I will explain how to test your events with a dedicated tool. Uh, so I assume you already have Pixel Your Site installed on your website and it will look something like this. This is the paid version of the plugin, so I have more features. If you have the free version, you already have everything you need there. So the first thing you need to do is to add the measurement ID in this field. In order to get the measurement ID, go, go to your uh, Google Analytics account, click here, admin, and then if you already have a property that you want to use, it's fine. You don't need to create one. If you need to create a new property, click on this button, and the process is very simple. I won't show it uh, in this video. So I assume you have the property uh, already made. Go to data streams, select web because we have a WordPress website, not an app, and uh, add the website domain and name your stream. Okay, uh, default settings are fine, create stream. This is it. Go here and copy the stream ID. You don't need to do anything, just copy the ID from here because uh, Pixel Your Site will do everything for you. So go back to Pixel Your Site, add the stream and scroll save. In theory, that's it. If you have a, a simple WordPress website without WooCommerce or easy digital downloads, there is nothing you need to do from here. We will start to fire events, to track uh, key actions with our automatic events. You can configure your own events. But if you have WooCommerce, there are some features that you maybe uh, want to use. Google Analytics Advanced Purchase Tracking. This one will ensure that uh, if a transaction or transaction didn't fire the default event when it was placed by your client for example they used an ad blocker or for some other reason we will send a um, purchase event using uh, api google's api when the order uh, status is uh, set to completed and also you can enable a refund so we will send a refund event when you refund an order in order for this to work you need to add some extra thing right here api secret we have short instruction on how to get api secret go back to your uh, google analytics account data streams click on the stream and right here measure protocol api secret create one okay review terms i acknowledge and now create one, nickname. And copy. Go back to Pixel Your Site and add your API here. Okay, save. And once you do it, those two features that I mentioned, we have them for WooCommerce and for Easy Digital Downloads. If you use Easy Digital Downloads to sell, um, plugins, for example, like we do, they are here and they are on by default. So this will improve the way uh, transaction, transactions are tracked and sent to Google Analytics. Uh, from here, you can control the events, click, and you can see what status uh, we have for each event. You can control the events for each tag that you might have installed um, and, and so on. So. Uh, on this page, there are many, many other uh, options. I won't explain them all. Um, keep in mind that Pixel Your Site tracks key actions with uh, standard or custom events. We have them right here on the main page. Enable, click to expand, and you can see what events we track by default. There are plenty. Uh, some of them are uh, also tracked with uh, default Google analytics for uh, events so for some you don't 
really need hours or you can set up hours in a different way. So you can also configure your own events. If you want to track a particular action, go to events, add and use the available triggers to define the trigger and so on. We have various triggers and uh, enable Google Analytics, select the property you want um, the event to be fired to, to sent to, select the event type and then you can add parameters and so on. So this is very simple. We have another video explaining how to configure events with Pixel Your Site. Um, one more thing, how to test your tag. Go to Google and search for tagassistant.google.com or go directly to tagassistant.google.com. Copy your domain URL and uh, add it here. Connect, simply browse your website, go back to Tag Assistant and you will see what events are fired. We fire all sorts of events, uh, some of them um, are standard, some of them are custom. I already have some events like time on page fired, uh, page view, browse your website, uh, perform the desired action that you want to check if it fires an event and you should be able to see the event right here. So for example, if you want to see if purchases are tracked, place an order on your website and look for a purchase event. And uh, you can click for more details and you will see what data is sent for each event. Uh, so that's it. That's how you can uh, add Google Analytics 4 using PC your site, how you can uh, enable API connection. So uh, WooCommerce and Easy Digital Downloads uh, transactions are better tracked by Pixel Your Site. And uh, keep in mind that for transactions, there, there is a considerable con a huge delay with uh, your reports. You might see them the next day. So sometimes I see it like a 24 hour delay for uh, purchase events to be reported under measurement, uh, under uh, monetization data inside your uh, Google Analytics for reports. I'm Christian Stoichescu from Pixel Your Site. Thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe to our channel and like this video.